Yo guys, what's up? It's your boy Retro88 and today I'm going to share with you all my top 5 sneakers of 2019. Yeah, that's right guys. From last year, uh, I'm gonna show you all my most favorite sneakers from my collection in, you know, five different orders. So yeah guys, it is one of the hardest decisions I've made. But yeah, uh, my mind's made up and it's time to show you all guys my top five sneakers from last year which I got through um, winning a raffle, copying it for retail um, and so much more. So yeah, let's begin. My top five is Boom, as you can all tell from the silver, metallic, shiny sneaker box, it is the off-white Nike Dunk Low, which I got um, just before Christmas. So yeah guys, this is the UNLV or University Red. Um, UNLV stands for University of Nevada. Las Vegas so yeah let me show you this dope sneakers so yeah guys um, what I love about this um, sneakers is the whole new um, look of this old-school dunks I love how Virgil Abloh um, incorporated his own creativity and design to it. Um, I love the whole second overlayed lacing system, which you can see with that bright red color. And of course, the red and gray color really stands out for me. And of course, it is an off white sneakers, so we get that usual um, standard quotation marks writing from the sneakers itself and the zip tie um, yeah I love the whole structured uh, concept of it so yeah that's my top five sneakers moving on um, so my top four sneakers would be is this boom again from the box itself you can tell it is a Travis Scott sneakers so this is the Air Force One low in fossil colorway um, and again what I love about the sneakers is the whole design um, is very unique and I believe that only Travis Scott has this kind of um, design concept. So yeah, let me show you what I'm talking about. Um, okay, let's just open this one out. Slide it like this. And yeah, so this was the last Travis Scott Nike collab for 2019 and so I'm one of the luckiest people who have managed to cop one okay let's go so guys this is the Travis Scott Air Force One Low in fossil colorway and as can all tell again the main reason was because of the whole um, different patches that is making up the sneakers there's so many going around like there's a um, premium leather material there's corduroy there's canvas um, so much things going on which I really love and it looks so dope um, 
and my favorite part is this you know zip um, overlaid um, from its laces so it's basically covering the laces and it makes it look like it's you know laceless or without the lace um, people uh, some people doesn't like it but I love it um, and the whole canvas layered with the cactus jack um, logo going around in different colors so yeah it is really popping um, I love the gum sole as well so yeah it's pretty unique and so yeah this is my top full sneakers okay guys so we're almost halfway uh, let's put this thing here so my top three sneakers would be this Yeezy 350v2 in black static reflective colorway um, if you've been following my YouTube channel um, I have said many times that reflective sneakers are my favorite ones like you know it really catches my eye and it's looking like you know pretty amazing um, it's a bling sneakers to me and obviously this is one of the most hype sneakers that was released um, last year but it was pretty pretty much limited so yeah it's a rare one so yeah guys this is the Yeezy 350v2 in black static colorway you can you can you can see it now that it's shining through the camera lens um, basically the 3m speckles making up the whole upper prime uh, material layer of this Yeezy is shining bright and it is you know it's it's a popping sneakers basically you know it's it's a flashy sneakers and obviously I love the whole pirate black version 2.0 um, that is um, making up the colorway so yeah and obviously it's easy so big up Kanye West for this one and he is one of my grail sneakers this was um, very hard to find and I'm again lucky enough to own one so yeah guys that's my top three sneakers so yeah we're almost there so moving on to my my number two sneakers would be this box I know you can all tell what's inside this box so yeah guys this is my top two sneakers and you know it was a very very hard to decide my top two sneakers because you know I'm basically basing it on you know how good the design is the comfort when you wear it um, the whole style of it and yeah I'm pretty much um, giving my reasons for picking up my top five sneakers based on you know personal way not because of just how it looks just how it you know it's hype in the market or hype in the community so yeah so yeah guys this is the Travis Scott um, Jordan 1 high in mocha brown and sail white colorway so yeah this was the first ever Travis Scott collaboration with Nike boom and one thing for sure my favorite part of this Jordan 1 high sneakers um, is this reverse swoosh only Travis Scott does that kind of you know creativity like I said from 
the top four sneakers of the Travis Scott Air Force One low um, with the whole collage of different patches material that is making up that sneakers so yeah basically this one is you know a very unique again um, besides the reverse swoosh I love the Cactus Jack face logo and of course the um, we got this where is it the whole the whole look of it it looks amazing you know I think I think everyone would agree man but I know some of you guys you you basically decide to make this as your number one you know sneakers of 2019 but for me it's my top two it's top two definitely top two um it is the like the og um the first ever the first ever released and yeah obviously it's a jordan collaboration no one will ever get it wrong of not coping a jordan one collaboration it's like travis scott slash michael jordan but you know og people from the music industry and from sports industry so hey guys um this is my top two sneakers okay so let's move on oh yeah before i move on to my number one sneakers this is the one i was talking about it has this hidden pocket inside where you can put a coin or crap protect wipes so yeah I almost missed that out but anyways it's time to reveal my number one sneakers of 2019 and this one is the Yeezy Free AE Alien. So this was my last cop of last year, um, 2019. And I was really, really happy that I really managed to get this one out. Um, you know, it was very, very sought after. Um, obviously, Travis Scott Jordan 1 High will remain as my most grail sneakers and the second one would be the black static yeezy reflective but this one really top everything from the four sneakers that i've showed you guys because of its design the comfort it's just amazing when you wear it i um, mean you try when i tried it on does it feel like i'm wearing anything it's so comfy very supportive and really I don't know it's like you're 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 in a white cloud or you're in a cloud white cloud nine you know you're just walking on air um it's pretty amazing design the technology um boost material was really upgraded um and obviously the alien um theme of these sneakers the whole style is really popping let me show you guys why Okay, so let's open it up. So, so Yeezy have done really well um, during the year 2019. They have released so much Yeezys from 350 to 380 to 700 to you name it to 500. There's so much Yeezy that came out, but this one really stood out for me. So hey guys, this is the Yeezy for AE Alien. Look at the whole boost cushioning from the heel part to the toe bit. And I love the alien um, skin like layered um, for the prime knit upper material it is amazing. And the translucent stripe with holes, it has some, you know, uh, uh, some 
touches of 3M Speckles. Um, in the Sock Runner um, fit. So yeah, basically it just like slides through your f your your feet when you wear it. It's just amazing, man. So yeah, guys, this is my number one sneakers of 2019, my top one. And I know some people would not agree, but hey, man, this is my personal stuff, personal view, personal opinion. Just sharing with you all my top five sneakers. So yeah, that's it, guys. So yeah guys, if you like this um, video, make sure to like, subscribe, keep supporting my channel guys. I'm aiming for 500 subscribers um, for this year 2020, so hopefully there'll be um, more to come for this year, especially on my YouTube channel, trying to bring up the best content that I can provide to you all. Um, so yeah, being a sneakerhead, you know, I'm up for like, you know sharing with you all the new releases, uh, the new collabs, uh, what's going to um, come in the future market releases here in Europe. So yeah guys, I hope you keep supporting my channel and make sure to smash that notification um, bell to keep you updated with more future sneaker vlogs. Alright guys, again, happy new year to you all. Enjoy 2020 and i'll see you on to the next vlog peace